Well, we'll just gonna make some noise here. There we go. is opening up but we don't care right we don't care all right so we're coming to you live tonight how's everybody doing it is wow it's already the 6th of February, Saturday, the 6th of February. My goodness, the time is going by fast. I am going to do just a couple of quick housekeeping things here as I get things set up for the live stream, and then we're going to throw on some tunes for you and, uh, you know, do our thing here, right? So bear with me as I get things rolling and uh, we'll start off with a track this is a tune called acid cell we got a whole bunch of cool tunes tonight a whole bunch of different submissions so uh, by all means jump online get your friends to join it's a cold I mean a cold Saturday night I mean here um, right now in my area it is 18 degrees Fahrenheit actually feels like five with the wind chill and of course in uh, Celsius that's minus eight or feeling like minus 15 so it's it's cold here It is definitely cold here. We're gonna start off with a tune for you called acid cell. This is by wreck neck
Oh, uh, yeah, that's a nice start to the evening, isn't it? That is Reckneck. Those guys are from Elderton, Ontario, just around the corner from me. Uh, father and son duo, and the drummer on that is 15 years old. He is a total prodigy. His name is Adam, and he is awesome. And we're going to have him here in the studio, actually doing a drum clinic here in the studio sometime in the near future, once these restrictions get lifted off us and we're through some of this COVID BS. Um, but uh, in the meantime, uh, we're going to be broadcasting some of this music to you. Uh, we've got some really great submissions. I've got some stuff. Uh, uh, it was kind of some sparse stuff, too. I didn't get uh, bios, and there was some uh, no EPKs with some of the submissions. I got stuff from Italy. We're getting stuff from all over the world, which is actually really, really cool. Um, we're, we're actually getting music from all over the globe, and that's going to be really cool because we're going to be able to share it with you folks, and uh, I'm really digging that. I'm um, going to flip over here and just talk a little bit just a little bit about the weather. Um, there's the weather right now. It's uh, minus nine here right now. And for those of you that uh, are still using British measure, uh, we'll flip that over. That's 16 degrees Fahrenheit, 18 on Monday. So 16 tomorrow, 18 on Monday, 25. We've got some snow in the next three days here. Um, we typically live in the snow belt here, and we can get some, uh, some pretty wicked weather. So... Um, you know, you just never know what you're going to get. Um, well, we're doing this. I'm going to flip back over to um, my mug. How's everybody doing tonight? I am going to um, pull up a couple of uh, tunes here. And um, this is in no particular order. These are a bunch of different um, tunes that have been submitted to us. And um, this is a friend from a friend of ours. These are uh, a couple of instrumentals. Um, this is um, from our friend Nick Beecroft. Uh, this is a tune called Mesmerize, and it's something that he uh, put together and sent on my way, uh, over my way, and uh, we're going to share it with you right now. Here it is.
That is a tune called Mesmerize. That's uh, submitted by our friend Nick Beecroft. And uh, we're going to play another tune by him a little bit later. And what we're going to do right now is we're going to uh, flip into some other stuff. So we've been getting music submitted all over the world. And uh, what's really cool is uh, we've got, you know, we have enough every week uh, to be able to um, put some music together for a show. And I think I've got uh, two or three other shows actually lined up. I'm looking at, you know, eventually bringing in um, a student or someone help me to produce this because it's, it, I would rather like, I've got some really cool backdrop stuff that we can use here in the studio uh, other than my motorcycle in the background, but that's, that's kind of kind of a cool backdrop anyway, isn't it, right? Um, that's Wicked Wanda sitting behind me. That's one of my rides in the summer. Uh, Wicked Wendy, her big sister, is over to my right and kind of tucked away in the corner. Um, this is uh, the back end of the studio or what we consider the co control room of the studio. So back in here we have a little bit of everything. We got a, a piano back here and I got some keyboards. I've got a couple of MIDI boards here. Um, we're actually working on some, um, some rap tunes right now where we're working on a theme. Yes, a theme song for Fat Boys Fishing. So if you haven't uh, checked out Fat Boys Fishing, I'm going to put a link to their stuff down below. You want to check out the stuff. These guys have been doing ice fishing all, all winter long, and they're broadcasting their, uh, their uh, time on the ice. And they are also broadcasting. They did a bunch of broadcasting in the fall where they were um, doing a whole bunch of uh, different type of fishing and getting these massive carp. I mean, huge Huge, huge carp. So that was kind of cool stuff. Um, but yeah, so by all means, if you have tracks to send us, send them to Indie Tunes. That's I-N-D-I-E-T-U-N-Z at gmail.com. You can find us at IndieTunes.com. That's our website. We are going to be doing some broadcasting off our website, and we are actually setting up a whole streaming service off the website and hopefully going to be offering that service very, very soon to independent artists to do some live streaming of their own. Yeah, that's cool, right? Cool stuff. Coming up, we got a, another tune. This is uh, from a guy over in London. And um, hang on a second. I'm just going to just bear with me because, because what I want to do is find... He uh, did a single. This single wasn't actually supposed to come out country. It wasn't supposed to be a country tune at all. And uh, this uh, fellow's name, uh, he goes by the name of Chris A. Young. And uh, he's got a tune. Um, oh. Okay. Okay. I'll check Gary. Uh, Gary Monroe sending us some music as it is currently. So thanks for that submission as well. Uh, so Chris uh, uh, wrote the song. This is a tune called Mofo Girl. And it was actually, um, uh, it was actually originally, um, oh God, hopefully this is, the. I don't know if this is the whole tune. If it's not, I'm going to have to dig it out and, and play it for you. So I'm not sure if it is the full length. It, it, it could be. We'll see. It's Mofo Girl. Nope. No, it's not. So <laughs> I lied. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to play that track for you in a little bit. It's a cool tune, though. It wasn't actually supposed to be a country tune, and it turned out to be a country tune, and we'll, we'll talk about that one a little bit later. Um, we're going to uh, play for you. This is a submission came by the way of a project called Hauser's, Hauser's Music, and it says, Hi, my name is Cristiano. I came across your radio show. Well, it's not a radio show. It's uh, more of a broadcast, um, podcast-type show, um, but it's, there's video, and uh, we're actually I'm recording this right now, and we're going to put it up on YouTube later and probably share it in Facebook videos. We're hoping this stuff trends really well because our goal is to eventually um, set up 
a, a means to be able to help these artists out in a tangible way where uh, people like yourselves listening to the music can actually download their music, which would really help them downloading their music, um, but also, um, you know, perhaps sticking some money in a tip jar by way of PayPal or by way of e-transferring uh, some coinage their way, and then we'll divvy it up amongst the artists. This comes from Cristiano, and it says, if you're interested in reviewing or taking us in consideration, I'd love to share our music to your audience. We can then share your site link all over socials and exchange. So that's a cool thing, right? That's the whole networking thing. What we're really trying to do is build an independent music network, which is much different than a music industry, which I really, really, really dislike. I hate, I really, really dislike what the, uh, the uh, mainstream music industry has become. And I hope that independent music does not go the same route. And by the way, it is growing. Independent music is growing at an exponential rate. And especially since these shutdowns, we're seeing more music being published than ever before. That's right. More independent music being published than ever before. So in the spring of 2016, four musicians from Milan, Italy, decided to make music as an art laboratory of art experience. They started experimenting in a peculiar way of composing, barely meeting and making music remotely from their houses. So these are, they're, they're barely meeting one another, but uh, creating the music independently and uh, from their own homes. Housers was born, and then since then, dozens of home-recorded songs were given birth, and each one of these brilliant pieces of music deserves to be discovered. Hauser's first record is about to come out and hit the mark for a new experimentation in the home recording of rock music, Cristiano. Thank you, Cristiano, for your contribution to tonight's show. This is a tune called Foul Mai. Here we go.
special, babe. All right, all right. So that is from our friends uh, way across in Italy. And uh, that tune, that particular tune, I'm just gonna, I'm just going back and forth between um, drives here. So just bear with me a second while I grab it there. Hauser's found my, all right. And uh, I, I got another submission. And it's from a band we're actually going to be doing an interview with. Uh, I'm, I, I'm not exactly certain yet. So, Pamela, you're going to have to uh, straighten me out on that because I'm not, I don't know that I'm, I don't know, sometimes I'm a little thick up here, you know. Um, so here's the whole thing. So Pamela Harbottle sent this to me, um, and uh, she represents a whole bunch of different things. Um, here's her, her note to me. It says, Dear Ken, thank you so much for offering to interview our band Slant 6. I think you will really enjoy their style. I've enclosed a link for the band's EPK as well as the song they will release on February the 9th. So this is coming out February the 9th, three days from now. Uh, Slant 6 is a band from Edmonton, Alberta. They performed a show as part of the Rise Up TV tour back in the fall. Would you like me to have them contact you to set up a convenient time? Thanks again. Warm regards, Pamela. Definitely, definitely. Um, there's an EPK. Um, I'm going to click here on the link, and uh, it takes it here, and there's a whole bio on the band. Talks about them being formed in 2015, influenced by the roots of blues and the love of rock and roll. The writing of their songs reflects this love for different styles of music, old and new, which makes the Slant 6 style unique and innovative. Slant 6 is always a pleasure to hear and watch and will leave you wanting more. Well, let's check it out. Here it is. Without further ado, this is Slant 6, Sweat Off My Brow. Yeah. 
That's Slant Six out of Alberta, and uh, we're gonna. I've, I got a feeling we're gonna hear more from them over the next little while. I got. Uh, I, I I found that uh, that tune for you. Um, I put the little teaser on there. It's like a 26 second teaser for it. Uh, the tune is actually called Mofo Girl, and it actually started out as something different. Um, sometime I'm gonna in, uh, actually interview Chris on here and have him get his guitar and. Maybe we'll do uh, a couple of live tunes while we do the interview. Um, but uh, this song was actually supposed to be just a, um, uh, something different, and it turned out uh, with a definitely country feel to it. It's called Mofo Girl, and here it is. School of Hard Knocks She's a well-mapped destination I'm a nameless A late-night drive She make the most of any situation I'm a lesson on how to survive I don't know how But she might I don't know how I But I'm glad she took the chance Was it grand design Oh, help and stand Now I'm a biggest fan In this great big world Lord knows I'm a She's my little mofo girl I'm beer straight from the can She's a pino in a proper glass She's all heart and soul And on me, I'm mostly just an ass She has a real go-getter She's always on the run Not me, I'm king of the couch I get up when this game is done I don't know how, but she might I don't know how, but I'm glad you took the chance Was it grand design or help and stands Now I'm the biggest fan in this great big world Lord knows I'm a mofo And she's my little mofo Biggest 
She's my little mofo Oh, yeah, that's Mofo Girl, and that is Chris A. Young from London, Ontario, Canada. And um, I don't know if he's putting anything else out these days. I um, haven't been talking to him for a while, so I thought I'd spin his tune tonight here and uh, let you hear it. It's a cool tune. It, like I said, it didn't start out that way. It didn't start out as an actual, um, you know, uh, country tune. Um, I'm, what I'm doing right now is I'm stalling for a little bit of time because I'm actually looking, trying to find, madly try and find this submission here. Um, there's a tune here that um, I have, and I, I honestly cannot tell you um, where this came from, but I'm going to throw the credit down below a little bit later. Um, this particular tune uh, is called... Um, Jeez, I don't even know. I haven't even previewed this one. I don't even know what it's going to sound like. You know what? Let's not do that. Let, we'll do maybe I'll, I'll preview it. We'll do it for another show. Um, this is another um, thing that we got. Um, like I said, we get all these different um, stream uh, stuff that comes to us. This is another one called says, "Hi, we are a fog funk band. Fog fro fog a frog funk band. Frog funk band." The Friendly Fogs, The Friendly Frogs Freak Show. Oh, my God. There's a tongue twister there. The Friendly Frogs Freak Show. I'm sending you our Bandcamp link since I, I, I was reading that uh, you're requesting music to live stream. And I, like, said, yep, 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 send me some MP3s. So they sent me a couple MP3s, um, and I'm hoping I get some more stuff from them. So let's take a look. Uh, I'm waiting to get some more information from them. But in the meantime, they sent me a couple of MP3s to share with you. And so here's the first one. It's called Let's Get Cooking. All right, <laughs> let's get good. Sounds like a little Frank Zappa.
Wow, that is Let's Get Cooking. That is from the, um, they are, well, it says, hi there. Our EP MP3s are Bionar Links, Amphibian, and Progressive High Octane Funk Rock. Perfect for your most colorful nights. <laughs> yeah. All right. Your most colorful nights. An infinite vortex of grooves backed by an electric rhythm section is sure to have you shiver down to your dancing feet. Yeah. And create an atmosphere that will surely bring out your inner frog. Yes. They call themselves the Friendly Frogs. Live stream fa frog funk. And they are called the Frog Funk Band, called the Friendly Frogs Freak Show. That is uh, a tongue twister. The Friendly Frogs Freak Show. And you can find them at friendlyfrogsfreakshow.bandcamp.com. Anyways, they sent me a couple of submissions. We're going to play uh, a couple of those tonight. And uh, I'm going to play another tune by our friend Nick. This is from Nick B. Croft. This is a, a tune entitled Song 2. That song, too, that is by our friend Nick. And um, we're going to play another tune for you right now. This is something uh, from a little project that I've been involved with. This is uh, um, something from a project called Green Ink. I'm just going to cue it up here for you. Bear with me a second here while I dig into it i got to figure out where it is. It's in here somewhere. I think it's right, 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 right here. And this is, uh, this is a tune, I believe. Uh-huh, it is. It's a tune called For You, and I'm just going to just back it up just a little bit. We got off to a false start here. This was uh, like a studio version of the song. And, oh, there we go. <laughs> yeah, there we go. 
See a little chipmunk going on there. All right, this is a tune called For You. Oh, yeah, here we go.
Brown. That's a tune called for you, and that's recorded live off the floor. Um, there are no dubs, no overdubs on that. That's a straight-up performance of that tune, and I wanted to share that with you tonight. That's some stuff we've been working on in the studio here uh, with our project called Green Ink. So check it out. We're going to be uh, hopefully sometime soon releasing an album, and I'm looking forward to that. That's going to be some fun. And uh, just to get our music out there in front of people. And at Indie Tunes Records, we put art ahead of commerce. So art is always more important to us than making money. And most of our artists think the same way. And that's why, partially why they work with us, because they, they're really interested in getting their art for as many people as they can. So our goal is to get it out in front. That was weird. Okay, so we just want to get in front of as many people as we can. Uh, we are going to switch gears now and uh, go to a, 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 a tune. And uh, this tune is actually really, really, I think, um, really um, timely because of the stuff that's going on not only uh, across the border in America, in the U.S., some weird stuff going on down there. There's a whole lot of strange stuff happening down there. Some strange science, and there's a whole lot of strange science happening here in Canada as well. Um, don't want to get into the de detail behind that because that could just take hours, and, you know, we're not here for that tonight. What we're going to do is share some more music with you, and this is a tune called Scared in America. This is Five Minute Walk.
that's Scared in America. That is Five Minute Walk. That's from a friend of ours, um, Mark Levesque. And Mark is with another project. Ha, um, <laughs> You guys are just bullshit. Here's Facebook. Matching content detected. Your live video will be removed soon if you continue to broadcast music you don't have permission to use. Facebook, how many times do I have to make my disclosures as a publisher to you? You idiots, you imbeciles. It's all right because we're recording this. So even if you mute my content, we're just going to pull down that and pop up another video. We're going to keep challenging you because you have no right to block our content. It is copyright protected. We own the copyright to it given by the artist who are giving us the permission to actually broadcast the content. So buzz off, Facebook. You are a social media platform. You are not publishers. So go away and go and fight Congress over this because you're already being sued for breach of trust. You're already being sued for a whole bunch of stuff. We're going to keep using your platform as long as we can to reach people, but we are going to be broadcasting eventually off our own, uh, our own platform anyway. So this will be inconsequential down the road. So Facebook and Mark Zuck and all of your minions, you can kiss my ass. That's right, you can kiss my ass. And there's a lot of it. No, there's not. But you can try. All right, so we're going to play one more tune for you tonight. This is uh, from a friends of ours in a band called Reckneck, the father and son duo, Adam and Kevin. This is a, a tune called Fifth Column by Reckneck, and then we're going to say goodnight. Take care, everybody. Here it is, Reckneck, Fifth Column.
is that is Reckneck. That is, those guys are from um, Ilderton, Ontario. Father and son duo. Adam, the drummer, is just 15 years old, and he is way ahead of his time. Um, I, I just love the stuff, man. Uh, thanks so much, Gary Monroe. Listening to your show with my wife Teresa in New Haven, Connecticut. Good stuff, Ken. Cool. <laughs> Eclectic mix of tunes. Thank you so much. Appreciate that. And it's Music Match, I think, that has been actually uh, grabbing our stuff, even though we've got the uh, the correct permissions and the copyright to be able to share the content. So Facebook may actually, um, we're actually working at blocking all of these fact checkers and all this other bullshit going on on Facebook. But in the meantime, we've recorded this. Um, so I'm going to take the video and put it up right after the broadcast. So that way, if you want to share it with your friends, please come on uh, my my page, Indie Tunes, I-N-D-I-E-T-U-N-Z, and check us out at Indie Tunes Records, I-N-D-I-E-T-U-N-Z Records. That's right. We're an independent record label from St. Thomas, Ontario, Canada, and we are halfway between Detroit, Michigan, and Toronto, Ontario. And you can find us on Facebook. Give us a like, but follow us, and then you'll get uh, notifications when we go live. Um, don't know if I'm going to do something tomorrow night or not. I might actually. I, I've got an old video of myself doing some, um, um, I think I was doing some riffs a while back, and I may actually put up that video again and then actually play guitar along with those riffs and see what we come up with. Um, and we are going to have a couple other shows coming up. We're going to talk about what's in your EPK. That's right. What's in your electronic press kit? I was talking to a guy the other night, uh, helping, uh, one thing that I love doing is helping, uh, other musicians to get their, their music out there. And one of the things we were talking about was this whole business of an electronic press kit. And then what are the four things you need to think about as a musician and where you need to go? Actually five, but we're going to start with. Facebook being one of them, Twitter being another, Instagram being another, and then YouTube. Definitely YouTube. And and I think it's important for you to generate content. And then the fifth one is get a website. Even if you decide to use the free one that, that companies like Wix offer, at least it's a start. But, you know, if you really want people to take you serious, you really need to think about getting something really professional um, I'm just going to show you a, a little bit. This is, uh, this is what um, a, um, the professional grade website actually looks like on Facebook. I'm going to see if I can pull it up for you. Hang on a second here. And there it is. I'm just going to see if I can flip it over here so that you can get a better look at it. And I'm going to size it for the screen here. So this is um, our website here. And I'll flip it over there so you can see it there. IndieTunes.com, I-N-D-I-E-T-U-N-Z.com. And there's our homepage there, Reinventing the Record Label, the home of indie music. Uh, we like to think so. And then we feature artists' work on there. And then there's a, a list of our current Roster right there, 14, I believe, right now. And a little bit of info about us. You can check it out and see where we came from, what we do. But we primarily are in the business of publishing, and we do a whole lot of stuff. You can actually go to the webpage. You can contact us for any questions you might have. Uh, I do free consultations with people via FaceTime. So, you know, feel free to give me a dingle um, on Facebook, and we'll hook up that way um that's all i gotta say about that and i'm gonna head out for the night everybody have a great evening take care of yourselves take care of each other and have a lovely evening <laughs>